to Principles of Accounting 2, BA 212. So this term we're going to continue on in the same book, right, that we've been using for Accounting 1. And we're going to start off with Chapter 10 and go through Chapter 17. So there's actually going to be eight chapters this term that we're going to go through. And uh, for the chapters, we're going to be using the same, uh, for the work, we're going to be using the same prerequisite structure. So there will be a couple of differences. Let me explain that real quick. So we're on the, we're on the uh, home page here. What I need you to do is go ahead and click on Start Here and work through the Start Here module and get d done with the welcome quiz. That's going to uh, allow me to, that'll be the first assignment, so I'll see you're participating in the, in the class, and then I'll be able to mark you as participating for financial aid and for student service purposes. So go ahead and do the Start Here module. Then you can go on to the coursework in the modules tab. So what we're going to have you do is we're, there's still extra credit with the interactive presentations. If you like those or, or if you just want some extra credit, go ahead and do those. Those can be very helpful. And what we're going to have is we're going to have uh, one chapter uh, per week. There's going to be a catch-up week on week five. And then week 10 will also be uh, the, a project catch-up week. Uh, so this term, what we're going to do, so let's go ahead and go through the weekly assignments, right? So you have the interactive presentation, which is extra credit. You can do it or not. That doesn't, doesn't um, impact your grade, but it could help it out, right, with extra credit. You've got the smart book, which is not a prerequisite for anything, right? But um, so there is no due date. That's one of the differences. Smart books are all pushed to the end of the term. Uh, although I suggest, right, that you do the smart book first, then you do the homework. The homework is prerequisite to the quiz. So you want to do your homework before your quiz. So homework, quiz, and then uh, you're done basically with the chapter work. Every week you're going to want to do your reflection journal. Okay, that's those are some easy points. Do the reflection journal and get the points for that every week. That's kind of a check-in with you and me. I'm the only one that can see it. Uh, go ahead and write down uh, how you did in the course that week, things you learned, things that were difficult for you. Uh, let me know through that um, as well, any suggestions that you have, anything you need help on. Uh, if you don't talk to me, you know, if you don't get a chance that week in class to talk to me, one-on-one, uh, -on -one, you can do it through the Reflection Journal. So uh, then we move on to the next chapter. This term, we have eight chapters. We have four exams. So there's an exam every two chapters. So that way, uh, we're doing exams more often. Hopefully, you won't have to hold on to that knowledge as far, right? So you're, the, the last um, ch term, for example, we had up to four four chapters in an exam, right? So we're only doing two chapters per exam this term for a total of four exams. Um, so that's you, you're going to need to finish the homework and quizzes at a 75% level or higher to be able to sit for those exams, right? So if you're if you didn't reach that level, then go back and and redo some stuff in the quiz and the homework you have unlimited attempts in those so you can go back and do them and get better and and hopefully fix some things if you're not understanding something we can help you get it taken care of then take the chapter uh, exam whenever wherever you want to right as soon as you're ready for it and then move on to the next set right so we're going to cover one chapter per week um, and at the end of the term so something that's new this term as well Go down to the bottom here. The very bottom is a financial analysis term project, right? So we have a term project this uh, this term. And what we're going to do is, I'll explain it more in class as we get going, uh, is you're going to have uh, a public, publicly traded company. You're going to pick one out. 
a publicly traded company that's traded on the uh, stock exchange so we can get their financial information right you're gonna take that financial information you're gonna do some analysis with it and you're going to uh, write a paper on it right so all the components are included here in the term project um, explanation and so that's going to be the term project for this term and so I'm super excited for this term it's going to be really fun and I think it's going to be a lot better than last term right so we just started out with accounting and all that last term which can be difficult for some this term we're going to move on and we're going to get a little deeper into some of the uh, business applications of, of accounting and um, it should be fun so We'll talk to you later. Have a good day. Bye.